Hello everybody, welcome back to Shaw Racing VR Does Collects. <laughs> what? Shaw Racing Collects VRs? Exactly. Okay. Uh, so, uh, today I... we're doing a double VR for an right. awesome channel that I've recently discovered. He does a lot of good stuff. It's Mark Santucci. Sorry if we butchered it. Sorry if we said his name wrong. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I said it right, yes. but just in case. Um, he's got 67 subscribers. He hasn't got a lot of videos. He's just starting to do the videos the last little while. Um, but he does really, really cool stuff. Um, he does a lot of music stuff. Um, a lot of it is music, his CDs and stuff like that. He also does cards. And he did... Uh, did uh, bleh. He has done a two-part VR which I've cleared with him that we can do both in one. And one of the VRs he wanted was um, at least two of your favorite guitarists. And the other VR is at least two rivals for your favorite team. Now, we've taken this and kind of threw it up on his head in the typical Shaw Racing fashion. Um, but we're going to start with JR and his... Yes. We've we've all done five favorite guitars. We're we're gonna we're gonna start with from me. bands and gu guitars from bands that we like. Okay. So your first one is. I'm gonna start off with uh, Richie, Sa Sambora. 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 Okay. Uh, because I listen to a ton of Bon Jovi songs, and so. And if you notice, instead of CDs, we actually have a bunch of music cards. So we went through and found the from, from different music cards to put on because we're a big truck card channel, but we love music as well. We always have music playing in the background. So the first one JR picked was Richie Sambora. Next up, the all star guitarist, probably ever. The all star? Jimi Hendrix. Hold on, let me <laughs> back out just a little bit. Jimi Hendrix. From the 91 Superstars music cards. Yep. And the um, other one's from Brock Rock'em Rock Cards. Yep. So Jimi Hendrix was your second favorite guitarist. Then we got Randy Ro Ro Romas. Randy Rhodes. Randy Rhodes. Yes. JR likes Ozzy Osbourne. And recently I've got him, I've been showing him all the, hey, the different you, guitarists. Did you know that Randy Rhodes is related to Dusty Rhodes? Probably not. Well, no, because Dusty's real name is Reynolds, so... <laughs> but Randy Rhodes was an awesome guitarist. Rest in peace. Um, yeah. Anyway, so number five, four, JR. Next up, we got Pink's, Pink Floyd's own guitarist, David Gilmore. I've taught my kids <laughs> proper music, in case you guys haven't noticed. Yeah, rock and, and roll. And number five. And we got Richie uh, Blackmore. Richie Blackmore from Deep Purple. Yes. He loves the opening riff from Smoke on the Water. So yes. Those are the five he, he chose. So, take him out real quick, and we'll go to AJ for his five. <laughs> yes, hello, I'm also here. AJ is also here. Okay. So, AJ, your first guitarist is... If you want, you can go left or right, or you can go middle, oh. or whatever you want. Zach Wild. Zach Wild. Uh, the, uh, he's in one of my favorite songs. By? Uh, by My Darkest Days. Yeah. Good job, AJ. That's and good. what's his name? Zach, Zach Wild. Wild. Correct. He does uh, a really cool song, in case you haven't heard it. It's called Porn Star Dancing. It is, he does <laughs> such an amazing uh, guitar riff in it. Um, for all you Canadian fans out there, Nickelback, uh, is oh, oh, I can't remember his first name, uh, Chad, Chad Kruger, 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 whatever the heck his name is, he's also in the video, he actually signed My Darkest Days to his record label, so he, uh, him and Zach are in it, and actually there's a version out there, Ludacris as well. Okay, your number two guitarist? Rick Nielsen. Rick Nielsen from Cheap Jack. Cheap I should, uh. You want me to zoom in on these a little bit? Well, actually, what you should do is show the camera and then take it out. Oh, okay. In the back. Okay, from now on. Yeah. Um, AJ is a big fan of Surrender and The Flame 
and every other freaking cheap trick song there is. Cheap trick song. Cheap trick song. Okay, number three. Angus Young. Angus Young from ACDC. You know what? Acids. We don't even need to say anymore. I've listened to way too many ACDC songs to remember them all. Well, back in my racing days, we, uh, ACDC was one of my pump-up songs before a race, so they heard a lot of ACDC. I'm, I'm surprised you remember back that Oh, lot. shut up. Hey, you button. Okay, number four, AJ. Ace Freely, without Ace, the makeup. Correct. And with that, you also have... A uh, kiss card. Um, you gotta turn it the right way. Not yet. Yeah. Kiss card. Kiss card. Um, I, Kiss was always one of my big uh, bands growing up, so they got to hear a lot of Paul and Ace and Vinny and Tommy and yeah, and Gene. You forgot about the most important one, Gene. Well, yeah, but he was a bass guitarist. He was. I was named all the guitarists. Well, technically, the lead guitarist. te technically, bass guitar is still a guitar. It's still a guitar. Yes. Um, okay, and finally, your number five is Tony. I'm I. Iomi. 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 From Black Sabbath. Again, need I say more? My so. favorite song from them was actually in the the original Iron Man TV show. Movie called <laughs> movie TV. And what was show. the song called? Iron Man. I am Iron Man. No, it's just Iron Man. I know. Okay, so take those five out, and we'll do my top five guitars. No, we've got all done different guitars, so you're actually getting 15 for the price of one here. No. Okay, I'm going to start with the legendary Jimmy Page, Led Zeppelin. Okay. Need I don't really need to go on more than that. Another one of the best guitarists ever, in my opinion, Eric Clapton. Mr. Clapton. He did clap a ton. Number three for me, Nuge, Ted Nugent. Catch Crack Fever is still one of my all-time favorite songs. You have to play that for us after the video. No ends. problem. I played before you before. Um, another one that I really enjoy. Don't have a lot of his stuff, but up a little bit, AJ. Ingve Malmsteen. Isn't he from Cinderella? No. Oh. He was on his own band, and he played guitar and and then, to me, an underrated guitarist. Um, there's two reasons why I like this card as well, and also like the guitarist. Um, I, it's to me, she is one of the best female guitarists of all time. You got to open it up, dude. You don't have to put it on. It can't stand up unless it's open. There you go, buddy. Why don't you put it sideways? There you go. See, yeah, it's that. a sideways card. He's there gonna, you go. He's gonna make it. Oh, the, oh. Okay, and my fifth and final guitarist is. Lit. Lita, Lita Ford? Lita Ford. She, uh, to me, she was a very underrated guitarist and a very underrated wow. <laughs> so, wow. So that is our uh, favorite guitarists for the first half of the uh, VR. And for the second half of the VR, he wanted you, uh, your favorite team. Open it. Oh, my goodness. They won't stand unless they're open, AJ. Okay, take the cards out. Actually, you don't need a couple of those stands either. Now, some of them we've only done one because just to because we have quite a few. We collect everything. So, so what we did is tried to do a couple different things. Now, uh, a couple different sports and whatnot. So, AJ, where's your cards? Or are you going first? Uh, AJ's going first, but okay. I think I should be in the main control hub why i don't know oh okay aj so what uh what sport are you doing first hockey okay so who is your favorite team put it in the middle you've made it too wide there you go so that is an autographed dave ellet card um so what is to you what are your one of the biggest rivals of the Maple Leafs. Carey Price and the Montreal Canadiens. Uh, yeah, that is probably one of the biggest rivals in hockey, let alone just the Leafs. And another one of their rivals are... Andre. Andre. 
Andreas. Andreas uh, Antonescu or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, Andreas. Detroit Red Wings. So those are the two rivals he picked for hockey. And baseball is next. And baseball is next. And your favorite team is? The Blue Jays. Really? Okay. Yeah, the Blue Jays. Okay. And their rival is? The Orioles. Orioles. Okay, that's... Okay, so we only picked one of them because you're going to see a bunch of these cards or you'll understand through the video. Okay, so that is his uh, blue J or his baseball picks. And the last one is wrestling. And the last one is his favorite wrestler. The Rock. The Rock. Hidden and the two of his big, biggest rivals were... Stone Cold Steve Austin. Stone Cold 316. And... And... Chris Jericho. Jericho. Um, there's nothing better than hearing uh, the promos between The Rock and Jericho. Those are two of the best talkers of all time. So that was AJ's picks for his ri uh, favorite and rivals. Now JR will do his. Time for me. Yeah. I'm going to start off with baseball. I'm going to be different. Okay, can you center the camera again? Because he kicked the table and moved everything. Absolutely. Okay, so to start off with baseball, okay. my favorite team, if you're brand new to the channel and don't know yet. And been living under a rock. Yeah, pretty much. It is the Expos. This is an autographed Randy Lynch card yeah. from the 80s. Yeah. And, everyone. and their main rival to me was the Blue Jays. This is a rookie card of Alejandro Kirk. It is also Alejandro. Whatever. It's also his autograph. Yes. The reason why I picked the Blue Jays specifically is because they were the only other Canadian team. Correct. So, it's Canada versus Canada out there. Okay. And then you're going to do your hockey? Yep. Then I'm going to do hockey. Okay. Another reason, another reason why you might have, you're, you're new to the channel or have lived under a rock, uh, my favorite team is the Jets. The Winnipeg Jets. And, and to you, their biggest rival is? Their neighboring province of man, Alberta, right. Edmonton, and Calgary. That's Good. Mark Giordano. Giordano. Blake on the Calgary Wheeler. Car. Yep. Blake, Blake Wheeler, Wheeler on the Jets card. Jets. And uh, Mike, Mike Greer. Greer for the Oilers. Yeah. And it's an autograph card. Yes, it is. Okay. So, JR's last rival cards... So you guys know how I'm into comic books and specifically in DC. Well, uh, that's what I did. Okay. I did Nightwing because he is my favorite DC superhero. Really? Gee. Well, actually, I originally liked Robin, but then the original Robin was Dick Grayson. So I just went with Nightwing. Cause he's, Dick Grayson he's... is Nightwing. Yes. Right. Mm. Okay. And his biggest rivals his are? His biggest rivals are Deathstroke. Hold on, let me try to zoom in a little bit here, because you're not showing the camera at all. Oh. Oh, yeah. There's the Nightwing card. And there is the Deathstroke card. Okay, you got to center it. Okay, and his other rival? His other rival is Blockbuster. Who I actually have been in one of the Nightwing comic books. Cool. Yep. So I hope you like JR's rivals, like AJ's. Now for me, I tried to go different sports. Um, okay, so my first, I'm going to do baseball. My favorite team is Toronto Blue Jays. That is... Sandy, uh, Sandy Martinez? Yep. Yep. And to me, their biggest rivals are... The New York Yankees. Now, I only did one rival of each because I did so many different sports. Um, next up, I have football. My favorite team. Of course, the now Las Vegas Raiders. Oh, really? Yep. Where were they before? Uh, L.A. Hmm. Oakland. 
They were the Oakland Raiders, the LA Raiders, now they're the Las Vegas Raiders. Okay, and to me, the biggest rivalry is the Kansas City Chiefs. That was actually kind of smooth. Sure. <laughs> so that's that biggest rivalry. Next up, I'm going to go to racing, because I'm big into racing stuff. And my favorite driver is Martin Truex Jr. And to me, this technically isn't a driver, but I'm going with Rick Hendricks. The reason I'm going with Rick Hendricks is he has four of the top teams right now. And last year, one of his drivers, Kyle Larson, won the most races. Truex won the second most. And another Hendricks driver, Chase Elliott, won the third most. So that's the reason I went with Hendricks, but his other two drivers also won races and are also there every week. And my final cards are, my final rival um, is first, show the camera. Uh, now this is the ladies uh, team, ladies captain, Cassie Campbell from Team Canada. And what I'm doing is actually going to Team Canada on this. So, and to me, Team Canada's favorite or biggest rival is, I know it's a baseball card, but Team USA. So that's, that's my rivals that I've done. I hope you like AJ's and JR's and my rivals. I hope you also like their guitarists. And yeah, thank you very much, Mark, for the opportunity in the contest. Um, I will get this, we'll get this posted and get you sent the link to you. Yep. And anything else from you guys? Nope. Nope. Other than? Other than? Go subscribe to Mark Santucci. Yep. He should have 100 subscribers by now. Why doesn't he? Because he's going to as soon as we post our video. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hopefully we can get him up over the 100 mark. All right. So thanks, everybody. That's all I got. And have a fucking good day. Thanks, Bye, everybody. Everyone. Bye.